Hello guys, this is Sharun here from 24/7 Techie, and in this video, I will be showing you guys how to update Redmi 1s. The Redmi 1s in my hand. How to update Redmi 1s to Android 5.1.1. We will be doing the same exact process what we did in a video some time back in uh, the Mi 3 Mocky ROM, and it will be based on Sun Engine Mode 12.1. As you can see, it's on default uh, uh, MIUI. It's uh, actually this is Xiaomi's only phone uh, right now, which is running on uh, MIUI 5 uh, in India, and that too also on Android 4.3. So yeah, this is the phone that is lagging behind, as you can see. So in this video, I will be showing you guys how to install. Android uh, lollipop on this phone running great. I have been using it for a while. So let's get started So first of all, we will download all the files which we, which I have mentioned in the description below It will be the custom recovery. I will also be showing you how to install custom recovery and uh, the second for, for, uh, file would be of uh, the Mocky ROM Instro download the top uh, top most link so that uh, you download the latest one and the third one would be gaps uh, google apps for uh, android 5.1 so after downloading it we will go into the updater app and uh, press menu and then we select update package uh, we will go to to the folder that we have uh, put the file in i put that i took that file from uh, a bluetooth uh, so I will be doing this and update so when the update will be finished I will be back so guys I am back when uh, the update has finished so now we what we will do we, we have two modes of uh, rebooting into recovery one of them is to switch off the phone and press the volume uh, volume up button and the power button together till till the screen switches on and uh, it boots into recovery or the second method is we will go into the updater app again and uh, there's a there's a option of reboot into recovery mode this is the easiest method of rebooting into recovery mode in MIUI Xiaomi does give us uh, a lot of options because they do uh, there's no other phone which will accept our uh, custom recovery like this so yeah they're good at this so guys as you can see we have booted into the recovery the first of all uh, thing we will do is backup we will create a backup this is the main thing that we will do because this is very important step because if we don't create a backup and if something goes wrong there will be a big half as that you will lose all your data and uh, maybe break it and uh, very difficult to re restore it Xiaomi does give us warranty for this we will uh, get it uh, recovered from the service center but uh, why, why to risk it if we can make a backup so we, we, will, we can make a backup into the SD card or the external SD card because uh, this phone does support a micro SD card so we can make it in an uh, external SD card so I have already made a backup so we will proceed to the next step after doing the backup we will go into wipe and uh, factory, factory reset we will not do anything else just a factory reset that's good enough yeah yes wipe all user data so guys after completing the uh, factory reset we will go back into the main screen uh, go into install zip uh, go to the location where we have saved the zip files and uh, I have saved it into the download folder so I will be going into that and installing the MK51.1 51.1 means 5.1.1 Android ARMANI Armani was the code name I guess was the code name for the MI3 MI, Redmi 1S because uh, I guess the Mi 4i had a code name of Ferrari so yeah Xiaomi names their devices like this pretty cool so we'll yes uh, we will do this 
and the flashing is starting so it will back after the flash is complete So guys as we can see the uh, flashing is complete we will go back into the the screen and uh, go back to where we have saved the gaps folder so then flash those gaps are uh, mainly very small so the flashing takes less time compared to the rom installation as we can see it's already complete so we'll go back we'll go into system reboot and now we will boot into the Android 5.1.1 on Redmi 1S. So guys as we can see the android is something in Chinese so don't worry guys this is actually android is upgrading uh, the rom is not in Chinese it just shows in Chinese we can change the language and uh, it will be all English so don't panic just uh, let the boot process finish. So guys we are done with the booting part or the upgrading part you can see we can select language so if you panicked about the Chinese language yeah so it detected India so it went to Hindi so now we will go to English and everything will change to English so guys as we can see it, it's taking a minute to boot uh, actually it's taking a minute to start uh, start normally so, yep now it's working okay so as I will show you first that you can see this is actually on Android 5.1.1 this is HM1SW actually this is the real model name of this phone HS HM sorry and Android 5.1.1 as you can see over here it's on Lollipop on Redmi 1S so yes guys it is possible custom ROMs are making it possible and the customization is also the over available over here so as we can as we are already as you guys would be already familiar with the as you guys would be already familiar with the Sun engine mode uh, customizations so this is all present over here the display and everything live display is also available so if we put it on automatic then the color adaptation will change according to the outside temperature and everything so I usually keep it off but you can do whatever with it all 180 degree rotation is also there ambient display is also supported double tap to sleep double tap to wake is still not added in this I guess they are not able to get that but double tap to sleep is there so that's good animations are also much more and the themes are also supported 
smart controls direct call to dialer and direct call to MMS I don't usually use it but you can if you want notification managers heads up notification is also included in this and lock screen buttons we can customize the buttons whatever they do uh, this phone is actually less than uh, 5.2 inch or 5 inch uh, the phones that are less uh, that are less than 5 inch uh, they do not support the on screen buttons Moki has never given uh, on screen buttons to those phones uh, as you guys would be remembering the MI3 also never had on screen buttons but you sh they should have given it but they don't we can battery mode also we can select as you all can see the customization is present over there and the phone is not heating up and uh, is performing well and the quick uh, quick toggle is also supported everything is going good and it will be a nightly update so we, you can see on the recording of the day it is the latest so guys this was an overview and a tutorial on how to install uh, android 5.1.1 on redmi 1s so i will be coming out with more of such uh, videos and uh, guys do hit the like button if you like the video hit the dislike button if you didn't but do leave a comment or a feedback of what you didn't like and i'll try to convert it into a like and guys do subscribe to the channel that really helps the channel to grow and uh, thanks a lot for watching the video cheers